Happy Wednesday evening. I'm meteorologist Rebecca Berry. Of course, we're keeping a close eye on the tropics. There's a system that's expected to develop a couple of hundred nor 100 miles north of the Bahamas, but the good news is whether it develops or whether it doesn't develop, it's still moving to the northeast, which is out over the open Atlantic and away from our area. We sure could use the rain though. Unfortunately, we're not going to get it. It's going to form just far enough away from us to actually dry our forecast out a little bit. As far as the forecast goes this evening, it's beautiful and mild, but dry. It's breezy for the early parts of the evening hours as we sink down through the 70s and get down into the mid 60s overnight tonight. For Thursday, it looks warm, dry and sunny. Expect mostly sunny to partly cloudy skies, winds out of the east around 15 miles per hour, and temperatures topping out in the low 80s, sticking to the upper 70s at the beach because of that easterly sea breeze. As we look ahead for the rest of the forecast, Friday we may see a few more clouds ahead of a mostly dry cold front on Saturday. It's not really cold and we're not really seeing any chances for showers. It's one of our best chances for rain this week, but it's only a 20% shot for an isolated shower or two to fire up as that dry cold front pushes through during the morning hours on Saturday. We'll top out in the mid-80s with clearing skies on Saturday afternoon. Still pretty breezy with winds out of, or out of the east around 15 miles per hour. Sunday we get even warmer hitting the upper 80s and then the 90s are back on Monday and so we are looking at increasing temperatures with still no decent chances for showers inside on the forecast which has elevated our forest fire danger. For more information you can read our detailed analysis on newsforjax.com. Have a great night.